But we do need to talk about this. Uh, Brooke Katz is joining me now uh, with a little bit more on what's going on. And we want to emphasize that we, we got to talk about this because we know that it is very much top of mind for so many people. Right. We're seeing so much on social media. So we know that you are seeing a lot about this as well. So we want to update you a little bit. First of all, this is all happening at Texas Wesleyan in Fort Worth and Collin College in Plano. Police are on the scene after scares, hoaxes that we're learning on both campuses. At Texas Wesleyan, we know an emergency alert was sent out after that turned out to be a scare. Am call to police. Our CBS News Texas chopper over the scene, and as it appears, everything is starting to get back to normal there. Meanwhile, Plano calling college. A very similar issue. A prank call about a mass shooting led to a huge police presence on campus. And look, we typically do not cover these sorts of incidents, but we know many of you are concerned. We're coming off the mass shootings that we've seen in Nashville and in Louisville. And quite frankly, we don't give coverage to prank calls like this because we don't want to feed into it. And we know that that can happen, but we also know that you are likely to see this information on social media. So yeah. we know this is making the rounds. It's top of mind. We don't want you to think that we're ignoring it. At the same time, we don't want to give credence to these threats because then that's when we see this right, happen right, again right, and right. again. And this isn't just happening in North Texas, by the way. We're seeing this around the country today. I've seen a lot of headlines. Again, I do want to stress police have confirmed that there's no threat at either of those scenes, but I did some searching. I've seen some headlines on similar situations out of Illinois, South Carolina, Missouri. We know Friday there was that scare that was on the OU scare. campus. So that turned out to be a case of swatting as well. So again, it's kind of a fine line for us. Honestly, again, we don't want to give credence to the people who are making these prank calls and give them reason to make more of them. At the same time, we know this is something that's concerning you guys at home. You have kids that go to those campuses. You want to know and you want to make sure that they're safe. So that's why we're bringing this to you today. The purpose here is to just uh, uh, invalidate whatever threat is out right. there and just let you know everything is okay. Yep. Brooke, thank you. Uh, let's hope this stops. This yeah. is uh, certainly not funny.